it's one of the best constitutions in the world and it's one of the non-practical constitution. So it's our right and it's our constitutional right to understand, to follow, to live by this because the constitution in our Amanda. <laughs> Too fat, too black, too white. Because of the Bill of Rights, I'm able to express my creativity. I have a voice. We are equally entitled to the rights and the privileges. To the rights and the benefits. To the rights. Freedom of expression. Our constitution is the most progressive in the world. Now, a simple yet powerful campaign, hashtag I am Constitution, is encouraging South Africans, young and old, to read, embrace and live it. Reciting extracts from the Constitution. For these pupils, a subject of a different kind. <laughs> and through creative arts, this complex topic is tackled. We want every citizen of South Africa to be engaged with hashtag I am Constitution. And now we want to take the discussion about our history and about our future to the streets. The I'm Constitution Road Trip is about celebrating 20 years of our constitution in South Africa, celebrating our culture, our heritage and our freedom. And the fact that we're travelling around the country and carrying this important message with us, um, I think is a fabulous, a fabulous way to create awareness. They want the constitution to be everybody's business. The Ichi Kovats Family Foundation and Travel Massive are on a mission. They want all South Africans to speak the language of the Constitution. They believe this is the best way to make sure government respects people's rights. People don't really understand or engage with it and that's what this campaign is all about, about each individual, each individual South African taking hold of the Constitution, defending the Constitution and celebrating the amazing Constitution that we have. You know, I'm embarrassed to admit that until very recently, mm. I had never read the Bill of Rights of South Africa. And our constitution is the only one in the world that the Bill of Rights sits in it. I am constitution because I am bigger than my stereotypes. This is the new wave of freedom. I won't lie, I don't know anything about in constitution. I am constitution because we are the community. In the absence of sanity, in the absence of objectivity, we have the constitution. It is not enough for us to sit back and be armchair critics and say, what is the Constitution doing for me? What have you done to act on the Constitution? We don't want to be a generation that sweeps everything underneath the carpet. I think one of the beauties of our Constitution is that it allows us to have a forum like tonight to openly express our views without fear or favor. I feel like the citizens of South Africa are undermining the Constitution, taking into consideration the things that are happening, especially bur the burning down of the schools. I believe in the Bill of Rights. I believe that I am a born free. Hashtag Constitution. <laughs> We have taken this discussion to university students, we've taken this discussion to politicians, and now we're taking this discussion to children, to primary school children. We've used the performing arts, we've used music, we've used the spoken word, and we want to be able to go out there and make this accessible to everybody. The Constitution is not just for adults, it's not just for, for people who are, are interested in law, it's for everybody. In Kwatuguza and KwaZulu Natal, they were led in debate by the daughter of Nobel Peace Prize laureate, Chief Albert Lutuli. We need leaders who are accountable to the people. We need leaders who really are selfless in the way they go about their work, their duties and, their, and themselves, you know, who think of people first before they think of themselves. Thank you.